with no end in sight. There is some relief on the way for thousands of furloughed workers. Our Jonah Kona. Yeah, Vince, good morning and a pleasant good morning to everyone. There are 300,000 government workers actually going back to work today. But don't thank Congress for this move. Thank Chuck Hagel. He's the Secretary of Defense who basically pointed the finger at civilian employees and said, get back to work. That decision bears special significance to the Wisconsin National Guard and the 128th Refueling Wing here in Milwaukee. Technicians will report to work today, and that actually includes a broad number of employees working on everything from wings to websites. Even with the good news, though, half a million people still furloughed, and now the shutdown claims another casualty. Without anyone to run the website, you won't find the Amber Alert program anywhere online. Amber Alerts displays urgent messages about at-risk missing children. It's instrumental at linking multi-state searches for those children. Meanwhile, pressure mounting on Capitol Hill today. Sunday talk shows provided as many hits perhaps as the Packers. Democrats were attacking Republicans, the GOP charging right back. The debate now, what will it take for a simple yes or no vote on a clean spending bill? House Speaker John Boehner is the only one who could call a vote like that. Vince? All right, Jonah, thanks very much. 633 and more local news now. Marine from Milwaukee.